Olivia, a Canadian wildlife researcher with a fervent passion for the untamed, had just concluded a remarkable stint in the Amazon rainforest, collaborating with a renowned television channel. Her work had involved studying the behavior and habitat of various wildlife species, capturing their dynamics with precision. Despite the accolades, Olivia thirsted for a new chapter in her adventurous career. Eager to explore the uncharted landscapes of her homeland, she conceived the idea of a senior exploration. Armed with her camera and an insatiable curiosity, Olivia embarked on a quest to unravel the hidden gems of Canada's wilderness. From the verdant forests of British Columbia to the rugged terrains of the Yukon, she traversed diverse ecosystems, conducting field research on elusive creatures and documenting breathtaking panoramas. Her lens chronicled the elegance of roaming caribou, the majestic flight of soaring eagles, and the serene dance of the northern lights, each frame a testament to nature's grandeur. The pinnacle of Olivia's journey unfolded amidst the serene beauty of the Canadian Arctic. In this icy vastness, she conducted research on the wildlife, studying the behavior of polar bears and their interaction with the environment. With unwavering determination, she documented their habits and quiet moments, capturing the resilience of life in the harsh Arctic realm. Olivia's senior exploration wasn't just a scientific endeavor. It was a symphony of ecological understanding showcasing the timeless allure of wildlife and the profound harmony of nature's symphony. As she returned from her research, her data brimming with valuable insights, Olivia knew that her work would echo the importance of conservation and inspire generations to cherish and protect the natural world. In the vibrant city of Florence, there resided an enchanting woman named Alessandra. Alessandra was a direct and determined young lady, always prepared to boldly overcome the limitations that stood in her way. She aspired to a life that transcended the ordinary. One day, while leisurely strolling through the narrow streets of Florence, Alessandra came across an antique bookshop. The window display featured a mysterious book titled Libertà di Sogni, The Freedom to Dream. Her heart fluttered, and she decided to purchase the book. Immersed in her reading, Alessandra entered a world of stories about women who courageously surpassed limitations and pursued their dreams. She learned about remarkable female artists, explorers, and inspiring leaders who defied stereotypes and achieved great heights. Feeling a fire within herself, Alessandra decided that her own story should be written within those pages. She left her small town and embarked on a journey where she encountered numerous challenges. Fearlessly confronting her stage fright, she began participating in open microphones and theatrical performances. Turning to the arts, Alessandra delved into the study of painting and sculpture. Gradually, Alessandra discovered that she possessed a unique talent in the arts that captivated and inspired those around her. She created works of art that conveyed her strength and dreams, leaving an indelible mark on the canvas of her own narrative. Duchess Eleanor was a renowned figure in town, universally known and admired for her extraordinary beauty and impeccable style. Her confidence and consistently attractive attire were not merely a reflection of her love for fashion, but a necessity for her role as the chief designer at one of the city's top fashion houses. Every day, Duchess Eleanor graced her workplace with a new, perfectly chosen outfit that emphasized her grace and beauty. Her creations adorned famous personalities making her a sought-after name in the fashion world. However, her talents extended beyond the modeling business. Duchess Eleanor was also a well-known philanthropist, always looking stunning at charity events. Her outfits were impeccable and elegant, making her the most attractive lady at any gathering. On a splendid evening, Duchess Eleanor made a grand entrance at a ball held at the French Palace. She was delightful in her long, crystal-embellished gown that seemed to glow with its own light. Her presence attracted everyone's attention, and she was surrounded by a multitude of people eager to meet her. Duchess Eleanor was not only beautiful, but also intelligent, well-educated, and her communication was charming. As she gracefully left the ball, still admired by everyone for her beauty and style, Duchess Eleanor felt that her outfit was her best achievement. She embraced the feeling of being the most attractive and confident lady on earth, 
ready to continue creating and inspiring others with her outfits and beauty. If you enjoyed the story, don't forget to like. Nestled along the sunlit shores of Bali, Indonesia, Surya's life unfolded like the rhythmic waves that caressed the island's coastline. Born of the fertile soil and immersed in the diverse cultural tapestry of Indonesia, she had become an integral part of the island's heartbeat. Surya, a mature woman with a spirit as resilient as the traditional gamelan beats that echoed through the air, wore her heritage like a crown. In the heart of this tropical haven, Surya was not just a resident, but the proud owner of a vibrant beachfront cafe. Her establishment, a colorful retreat nestled between swaying palm trees and the turquoise sea, was a testament to the warmth and vibrancy of Indonesian hospitality. Travelers from around the world sought refuge in the soothing melodies of traditional gamelan music and the tempting aromas of local delicacies, all curated by Surya's skilled hands. As the sun dipped below the horizon, Surya's cafe transformed into a lively hub where cultures converged and stories unfolded. The laughter of travelers blended with the soothing tunes of traditional Indonesian music, creating a symphony of joy. Through her cafe, Surya became not just a business owner, but a cultural ambassador, sharing the spirit of Bali with every visitor who crossed her threshold. In Bali, where the sea meets the soul, Surya's beachfront cafe was a beacon of warmth, a place where strangers became friends, and the essence of Indonesia lingered in the hearts of those fortunate enough to share in her vibrant life on this island paradise. Hello everyone, and welcome to the Dressy Time channel. In this video, we'll showcase remarkable women who have gracefully crossed the age of 50. Their confidence shines as they elegantly embrace contemporary fashion, appearing younger, charming, and absolutely beautiful. Keep watching until the end to gather ample inspiration from these incredible individuals. Don't forget to show your appreciation by liking this video, leaving a comment, and subscribing to the Dressy Time channel for more fashion inspiration and timeless elegance. Thank you for joining us on this journey.